April 5th, right before worship, had a phone call that they were hauling my dad into hospital by ambulance. Not great news. Uh, just earlier in the week, uh, Sheena had a call from the facility her mum and dad were in, uh, saying, hey, with this uh, pandemic, we're just uh, checking things out because if staff uh, get sick, we're going to have to have family members come in and look after uh, the aging parents and the two different ways that Sheena would have to do that. Then on top of that, there's, of course, the concerns that we have about the economy and the finances and the church and and so on. And, and uh, so last night, uh, Sheena just said, Alan, you know what? What if all this just comes about? What if it all comes crashing down, all these things together? And uh, deep out of the, the depths of history or something, I, I just said, uh, one day at a time, sweet Jesus. And I remember that's a, an old song from right back when I was a teenager, I guess, and first become a Christian. I, I kind of looked it up. It's one day at a time, sweet Jesus. And that's all I'm asking of you. Just give me the strength to do every day what I have to do. Yesterday's gone, sweet Jesus, and tomorrow may never be mine. Help me today. Show me the way one day at a time. You know, it's a good lesson uh, for me, a good reminder, I think, for all of us. And one of the things that this pandemic has taught us is that it's good to plan for tomorrow. It's good to think ahead. But the illusion of control, the illusion that we've got a handle on things, the illusion that we can dictate how even next week is going to come about is uh, quickly done away with as the different regulations and the different circumstances come about. It's tough in these changing times. Reminds us that we can't control it. But at the same time, we can't worry about it either. Uh, Jesus said this, but seek first his kingdom and his righteousness. And all of these things will be given to you as well. Therefore, do not worry about tomorrow. For tomorrow will worry about itself. Each day has enough trouble of its own. And in the midst of each day, we have our Jesus. One day at a time, sweet Jesus. That's all I'm asking of you. Just give me the strength to do every day what I have to do. May the Lord's presence just remind you that he is here today. Yesterday's gone. We might not get tomorrow, but today our Jesus is with us. May you know that deep down inside you during these troubled times. God bless.